mistake you made Sink to the bottom with no purpose Or be successful with the yacht floating on the surface One day you made, had a feeling you lost it all I have everything you want for what it cost the ball One day you made, feel like you was born to fail Or keep your rap sheet clean and stay above the jail One day you may follow a team by any means Or be a leader in success, create your own dreams One day you may pull all the bad luck on the shelf No money, can't eat, take a shot to your health Hey, what up everyone? We're here at Metroflex, killing it today Got my boy Viking, he might show me a little bit on the on the back today, Because I don't know what the fuck I'm doing I'm out. I'm out. So anyway, we're here to pick his brain, get inside his head and Find out what it takes, you know, to be a fighter Walk up that alleyway, get in that ring Shut the cage and just go to you know go to town or or walking down a backyard, a bunch of people you don't know, don't know what to expect, and just throw it down. I mean that's something I never I, I've never experienced anything like that. So let's get inside your head and tell me what it's like. That's what I'm used to. I'm used to the backyard shit, from that to the underground shit. Um, my stuff's always been on the down low. It's been low key. It's been it's been underground based basically because it's always been for the thrill of the fight. I just I like to fight. Um, it turned into to, to a passion of mine where I wanted to take it, you know, official. And uh, 2014, I'm looking to do that. I'm looking to, uh, you know, take it into the cage on the television for everybody to see, showcase my skills, what I truly, truly got, rather than just, uh, you know, brawling. My street, my background is, is from the street. Um, growing up, fight after fight, as a lot of guys do. But, um, Mine's on a, on a, on a, on a, gonna be on a whole new level for the new year. Like I said, I want to show the, uh, showcase the skills that, that I've been working on in the gym. Yeah. See, I think from a lot of people that haven't been in this situation, like we've all been in fights, we've all gotten down, but it's kind of like a spontaneous. Something happens and boom, and you're pissed off, and it just goes off. But to actually think about, I got to fight in an hour, no walking down the alley. Yeah. I don't know this guy; he didn't do nothing to me. I ain't yeah. mad at him, but I'm gonna get in there. I'm gonna try to kill him. Yeah. Like, like it's just gotta, you know, gotta take a while to build up that kind of a, a mentality. A you know? street fight's a street fight. There's no rules, whatever. Um, you know, but we've all done it, and uh, like you said, it's spontaneous. There's no, there's no anticipation. There's no build up. Going to do an MMA fight, it's a whole different story. That anticipation can kill you if you're not if you're not careful. I mean, you can you can have an adrenaline dump and uh, dump your load before the fight even happens. Just the anticipation, you're so eager to get in there and turn it loose, you know. And I've done it. I've done it. Um, I've went in there and, and been fought angry, um, been knocked out, fucking cold. Because of that, you become vulnerable. You know, technique goes right out the window. Everything you've been training so hard for. But um, it's, it's that anticipation you're talking about that I know what you're, you're asking me about. And uh, you got to learn to really, really handle that in, in, in a way that, uh, you know, doesn't have a, a reverse effect on you. Um, you got to keep that positive mentality yes. that I can beat this guy no matter what, no yes. matter what, no matter what he looks like, no matter how tall he is, how big no he is, how no much doubt. he weighs, I'm going to run through him. You know, I mean, even in... Bodybuilding can't even can't even compare to fighting. There's no comparison. Okay, sure, sure. bodybuilding ain't a sport. I'm not talking shit. I love bodybuilding, but you know it ain't really a physical sport. It's, For sure. You know you're up on stage and whatever. But even backstage pumping up, you look at other guys, and a minute in your mind will say, "Oh fuck, I think that dude's bigger than me." Right. Well, you're fucking right there. You're failing. Yeah. You're losing. You're you already can't. fucking losing. Right. That minute that negative thing pops in your head, I think that guy's bigger than me. Fucking over to Same thing. You look across the ring, you go, "Fuck, this dude's kind of big." Same thing. Done. That's Unfortunately for me, that's uh, I'm usually there on the receiving end of that. I, I, I got no fear. I fear no man. What the fuck is um, it's, it's exactly like you said. It's exactly like you said, though. The, uh, and I can't stress enough the anticipation. You got yourself for one, you know, one moment. That's it. That's it. Go home. Be it. Don't even step in the ring. Don't even, you have no fucking, fucking get a business. side ache. Fucking get hurt. Go and, the fuck and in, home. In the fight game, if you, if you even allow your, if you, if you even allow yourself to do that, if you do it, you got no fucking business. Yeah. You just got no business being there. Like, you got to fucking lie. That's with, that's with everything. Positive. Everything. Positive. Everything. everything. You got to be positive. positive. You got to believe. You got to know, you know, I'm going to go in here and I'm going to fuck this fool up. I'm going to fucking take him out, you know, any means necessary. It's, you know, I'm not going to leave it to the judges. There's no fucking way. I'm going to fucking take this fool out. And that's it. It's, I mean, I'm offensive minded. You know? I don't know what the fuck, uh, uh, even considering what the fuck, you know, it would be like to be on the losing end. You know, whether you've been on the losing end or not. We all have. Now, but, uh, now I, I know you have promoters knocking on your door. I know you're talking to people. I know people want you. I mean, are you actually going to take that step and get back in the ring? That's what I'm going to do. I know you're making money doing what you're doing. That's but what I'm going to do. I, I know, you know, you also want to be in the ring. And, uh, see. I've been making that easy cash doing the whole fucking underground. And it all started off because it was cool, because I love the fight and whatever. But um, I wasn't around the right people. Um, now I am. I got a whole new, you know, 
training camp. Uh, before I'm too fucking old to do this shit anymore, I want to uh, make it, you know, I want, I want to get myself seen. I want to make it, you know, go out with a bang. And uh, I'm going to get with the, the, the right promoters. I'm going to get with the right shows. I'm going to sell myself. It shouldn't be too hard. And I'm going to get out there and I'm going to fucking showcase my skills. And I'm going to go out with a bang. Just take it, you know, year by year for what I'm going to get. But um, that's why my motto is going from the street to the cage. That's uh, my background. I want to make it official. Showcase what I got. Sure. It's awesome. All right, well, I look forward to Viking being in the cage and 5% is for life. That's right. Look for me in 2014. <laughs> All right, brother. Making, making it official, coming out. No more, no more street shit, no more underground shit. I'm going to uh, do my thing. You know, I'm a big screen for sure. Look for me. One day you may sink to the bottom with no purpose Or be successful with the yacht floating on the surface One day you may have a feeling you lost it all Or have everything you want for what it costs the ball One day you may feel like you was born to fail Or keep your rap sheet clean and stay above the jail One day you may follow a team by any means Or be a leader in success create your own dreams One day you may pull all the bad luck on the shelf No money can't eat, take a shot to your health it seems no matter what you attempt, won't nothing prevail. Fatigue is getting real frail, I'm getting low on the scale.